Hey beautiful humans, I'm here with the most stellar dad on the planet and man he just loves so well and he has a heart for God that has blessed me in my walk with the Lord. So we want to share a song with you today and it's all about who God says you are. Whether it be you telling yourself or the world telling you, um, we're often hearing a lot of voices that you're that you don't measure up, voices of insecurity, voices of rejection, voices of um, fear. Um, and so I just wanna encourage you today that the Lord says that you are His. The Lord says that you are worth dying for. He so loved you that He sent His one and only Son to die for you so that you may, if you believe in Him, live with Him forever. Dwell in His house forever. You are who He says that you are. Who am I that the highest king would welcome me? I was lost, but he brought me in all oh, his love for me. Oh, his love for me. Who the sun sets free. Oh, it's free indeed. I'm a child of God. Yes, I am. Free at last, He has ransomed me. His grace runs deep. While I was a slave to sin, Jesus died for me. Yes, he died for me. Who the Son sets free, oh, is free indeed. I'm a child of God. Yes, I In my Father's house, there's a place for me. I'm a child of God. Yes, I am. I'm chosen, not forsaken. I am who you say I am. You are for me, not against me. I am who you say I am. I am chosen, not forsaken. I am who you say I am. You are for me, not against me. And I am who you say I am. Who the sun says free, oh, it's free indeed. I'm a child of God, yes, I am. In my Father's house, there's a place for me. I'm a child of God, yes I am. We love you. So God, do you have any encouragement or any words that you'd like to share with those sweet humans? When Emma came home from the hospital, it was one of those moments that we didn't uh, know exactly what to do. We literally sat her on the counter in the car seat and said, what do we do with it? And we had really no idea. And then you, you start watching others, how they raise their children and praying that you just do it well. And I am a flawed human being and I deserved a daughter that was unfaithful, that was mischievous, that was dishonest because that's exactly who I was. And I never thought in my wildest dreams that I would have a daughter and a son that were loyal and obedient and 
following after the Father. And Emma is one of those people that loves so well and loves others and has the eyes of Christ to be able to see the hurting and the broken. And as a father, one, I never thought it was possible. And two, I never ever believed that she would be who she is today and being the example that she is to me and literally raising the bar every day so I have something to even not only look up to, but to um, to be so proud of in every day of our journey. Thank y'all so much for joining us today. I pray that this encourages you. I pray that you remember that you are who the Lord says that you are. And when you begin to see yourself the way God sees you, you can see other people the way he sees other people. So walk in that today. Know that you're loved. Know that you're seen by the Father. And we will see you next time. I love you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you.